After the excitement of our 100th live episode, we wanted to update you all on what really matters. Matt's sick chicken, Matt's new cat, and most of all, Bubba's bent back. And trust me, I haven't laughed that hard in a while. It's a good story. You're going to want to hear it. We catch up on the latest that we've been playing, what we're looking at playing, and more this week on the Free Play Podcast. You are listening to the Free Play Podcast with Bubba Stallcup, Matt Warmbier, and Kate Katawaki, part of the Love Thy Nerd Podcast Network. What's up, nerds? My name is Bubba Stalkup, and you're listening to Free Play Podcast, part of the Love Thy Nerd Podcast Network. And join with me, as always, when there is an always, are a couple of my co-hosts and a few of the co-founders right here at Love Thy Nerd, Matthew Warmbier. Uh, it's, it's a pleasure to be here. Uh, hey, yeah. new, hey, hey, episode what? 101, it's a new map, new season, new map. It's not it's a new you. season. Warm beer. We did not. We didn't vote on that. No. And Audit. also, Kate Kawaki. Hello. Kakawaki. Yep. It me. It me. Uh, I was talking to Chris earlier today, and he was. He said, "What did the kids say?" It me. And I was like, "I don't know." <laughs> All the kids no. are saying that. I've heard. Man, you guys them. keep me. You you guys keep me young, and I appreciate that. I'm I'm becoming an older man. How old are uh, you? That, None of your beeswax. Uh, <laughs> he still so, says he knows what beeswax is. What does that tell you? I was born mm, in 1997. 1700s. Oh, well, no. You're only a I'm, couple years older than Kate. More yeah, than 1999. I'm 38. I'm 38, years. and I feel like I know a lot of the uh, the lingo of the kids. <laughs> so, like, I feel getting like I can, I can keep up with the chitlins. <laughs> It's 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 that uh, hey there fellow youths. Oh, it, you know, my it, gosh. Me. it me fellow youths. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, somebody clip that. Yeah, let's go. Clip it and oh, burn what? it. Um, <laughs> hey, we are here on episode one hundred and one. This is it's not a brand new season. Oh, that would have like been a smart Dalmatians. thing to do. It is now. I have already announced mm. that you didn't. No, if it's you wouldn't not. have said anything, it would have been just fine. No, it's not a new season. From That's the top. I mean. It's time. a new <laughs> era. It's more a new Back era than a new season. Is that what you're We trying should to have say? done something <laughs> special, but we didn't. We were just like, hey, you guys want to like do a podcast? Or like, What's no, because we did something special for 100. What are you talking about? One and done. Well, Episode 101. Every- this is what we're talking about. Matt, we're doing a podcast right now. Are you aware of that? I, what I assumed, we were just going to roll back into how we'd been doing it. Mm-hmm. You, guys are get, you guys are listening to Mommy and... Yeah, daddy and daddy <laughs> talk here for a little bit. Okay. Uh, just continue. Well, what you we're decide doing. who's who. Yeah. Yeah. And after LTN Con, when the new computer's here, we'd be able to do more live video podcasting via Twitch. Oh, yes. is that true? So this is another like textbook <laughs> case of Matt in his own head. So he's not wrong. We just never talked fine. about any of that stuff. And he's we didn't also need not to. right. Wait, not right. after you get to episode <laughs> ninety of a podcast with someone, you, you get a new you computer just, and you go video. No, and you just know what the other person's, the other people's, mm. are thinking. And we've done probably close to two hundred as a as maybe, a, oh, but as a trio I don't know. I, that's not what I was easily. thinking in my head. I was looking at this well, okay, can of sparkling water, so that's where I was thinking. <laughs> Hey, I found a lot of uh, a lot of the old podcasts. Like I have them. I, I found them. They were in my old Google Drive. Oh, oh. Old Google. Yep. Obligatorial. So I'm I'm clearing out my Google Drive. Which, by the way, I did not even know this was a thing. If your Google Drive gets too full, you cannot get email anymore. Oh. And so that happened to my soon-to-be debunked church account. So what? And where? What era were these podcast recordings from? Uh, uh, so they go, they go back to Brooks. Oh my gosh. Mm. So it was, it, so it, it's, it's pre Kate. Yeah. Oh my gosh. That's awesome. Yeah. Did it's, you uh, listen it was, to my uh, intro episode? Or your intro? No, I, I wouldn't, I would never mm. do that. That one probably got deleted right away. 
Absolutely. Yeah, I, ma- I made a solemn vow to myself and nobody else. <laughs> and here I never... make my solemn vow. I will delete Kate's podcast someday, somehow. Somehow. <laughs> Look gone. what you did. Mm-hmm. Podcast Matthew Warmby. Gone. He's smiling, guys. He's very proud of himself. I'm for on it. Hey, I'm on it. <laughs> I had one sparkling water explode Ooh, on me. Ooh-wee, 40%. <laughs> um, so we are... Story. We are here. We are doing it. Episode 101. Thank you guys so much for taking this journey with us. And obviously, I, I apologize if I say guys. I'm trying. Here's a little peek behind the veil for Bubba. I'm trying to not say guys anymore because I do realize that there are more than just guys that listen to this podcast and more than just guys that watch our Twitch stream or do whatever. But it's so ingrained in me. And I don't know about you, uh, fellow yes. humans as well, but I say guys just all the time. I mean, I'll, yeah. I, I'll yeah. talk to just, I'm looking directly at just a group of women and I'm like, Hey guys, what's up? <laughs> and I'm like, my bad. I, I, I don't, I don't well, mean, I don't say? mean Are what you I say. say. Hey girls, what's up girls? Uh, hey, I think it's lady. Hey, grills. Hey, grills. Yeah. When I was a uh, server at Bob Evans many moons ago. That had to have been a thousand years ago. Many moons ago. I don't even know what that I, is. Yeah. <laughs> Bob Evans? <laughs> what's that? Well, it's Bob Evans, of course. I don't know it's what a, that is. It's Do you a, know what like, McDonald's is? It's like a breakfast yeah. restaurant. Because it's nothing like McDonald's. It's oh, like okay. a breakfast home home style like restaurant. So what, like Just, Cracker Barrel? Denny's. It's, it's, it's yes. like a Denny's. You know, Denny's? It's, more, it's, it's probably somewhere in between those two. Okay. Denny's Anyways, Barrel. I was a server at Bob Evans, Robert Evans, <laughs> and uh, I came up to this table with this, this elderly couple. I said, hey, guys, how, how's it going? And the, the man looked at me. He's like, we are not guys. And I was like, I'm sorry. I, I apologize. And then I immediately said, all right, th- well, thanks, guys. And I immediately said, right there, I was like, you've got to be kidding me. He didn't say anything then. He didn't say anything. I'm hoping he didn't hear me. He so what was the tip up. that you got? Yeah, you that's my question. They actually tipped decent. Like, it was like, you know, like a f- Decent for people who'd seven. been offended. Back in the yeah. 90s, like, that was pretty good. Like, 91. Ooh, 91 or 92. 50, 50 bucks in the 90s right there. <laughs> yeah, basically. It's like uh, a 90s 50 right there. So I do a terrible a terrible job. That's why I just I, say, hey, hey, yo. Hey, <laughs> nerds. Nerds is good. Um, I might just kind of stick to nerds. I've been trying. We're on Twitch now. I don't know if you guys. Dang, what? I did it again. I don't know if you, you, you everybody, everybody, y'all you all, all no, knew no, that like we say, were on Twitch. I like Twitch. to say boyo. Boyo. Ayo. No, like I don't know. Boyo? What's going on? I don't on? know if you all were aware of it, all of you. Um, uh-huh. but we we are on Twitch. And so Matt streams, I stream. Um, there's another stream, guy, stream. I can say this because he is a guy. Mm-hmm. Um, his name is Frost and he yeah. streams for us as well on Mondays, except for this this past Monday, Matt will have What's done that. Up? Matt, hey, Matt, you had a great stream on Monday. I just want to let you. you know. I really appreciated <laughs> all of you. the... I can't believe how far I got in that game. Insert yeah. stuff you did here. Like, oh. I just... Wow, man, it was fantastic. It was a good game. Yeah. What, um, what was it? Ghost of Tsushima. Mm, yeah. Sure? Yeah, I get through it. Yeah, I gotta get through it. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It definitely wasn't any other game that you haven't played yet because it is Monday when we are recording this. But... He he streams, we stream, we all stream for I stream. And so Same. we are getting in there and I'm trying to not say guys live. <laughs> I want to say hey, like chat or something like that. Like some hey, generic chat. It's hey, me, chat. Bubba Stall Cup. I don't it, it doesn't Bubba Stall Chat. <laughs> other people have used that and it works for them. Hey chat, what do you think? Oh chat, chat, chat. you know, like it like Chat is one conglomerate person, you know? Yeah. I think I might just settle on nerds. Yeah. I, I think I might go nerds. there. But oh. you're, you could totally offend somebody, though, who's in the chat who's not a nerd. Well, so they're they're in the wrong spot. Do? What are you going to do yeah. now? I think I just say, hey, everybody. Hey, everybody. Hello, you said, everybody. hey, nerds. <laughs> the other day. Yeah, it just came out of me. And it felt like weird a, like a to demon. even hear it. Yeah, I was thinking about me like a demon coming out of my mouth. Say it the way that Michael Scott says it when he goes in to do that like health presentation and he's wearing like a suit that's like really big. Hello, everybody. <laughs> Say it like Hi, that. everybody. Okay, I'll, I'll work on it. Yeah. Hey, <laughs> tune in last Monday to find out what I said. <laughs> All you guys tune in on All last y'all. Monday. All y'all. Use guys. Um, yeah. So, hey, let's go ahead and push this forward. We're going to be trying some new things in the coming weeks. Like what? We do want to get more. I'm just 
I'm just kind of Hold on, let him finish. I'm <laughs> teeing it up, you know? It's going to be- He sent you the mental doc. You can It'll get it. be what I it is. It. My doc, my drive's full. <laughs> yeah, uh. and don't you dare question my generic <laughs> ramblings here. But we are going to be trying some new stuff, and one of the things is being on Twitch more frequently, but we cannot do that, like Matt said, until we get the new computer in, which Chad freaking built- Oh. on Twitch. Oh, that was so awesome. If you want to see a real nerd in real action, look at that. Chad is a real nerd for sure. <laughs> like that. I don't think you could have described him any better. And Chad, you're sense. great. Chad, you're, I love uh, you. 10 out of 10, Kates. <laughs> Chad's got some ideas. I didn't tell you, Matt. Um, I talked with him the other night, and we talked oh, through did. some of his ideas. Yep. Was I in bed? <laughs> no, you... you you were playing with Shane. That was like your mantra for the weekend. Oh, hey, Matt, what are you doing? Oh, Shane's over well, again with Shane. I, I hadn't seen Shane in, well, I guess since last Gen Con. So All you do hang- is you go over to the Facebook and you type in Shanathan Reed, and then you just click on his picture, and you're like, oh, that's an <laughs> album cover. Forward, there forward, is. forward. There he is. He's right there. Okay. Yeah. Well, perfect. I spend time with Shane every day. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, how was your time with Shane? It was great. Was it was it really good to hang blessed, out with him. A blessed time. Yeah. Blessed Hashtag up. blessed. <laughs> we played a lot of, I'll tell you later. Oh. 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 oh, oh. And it was good to hang out with him. And we, hang, we hung out with our friend Jason. Shane and I went to high school together. Jason went to high school with us as well. And Jason lives here. So uh, Those are two really fun people to hang out with. They so it was are, like a high school uh, reunion. Well, let me rephrase that. That sounded very <laughs> insensitive. Those are three. Really fun people to hang out yeah, with. I wasn't sure which of the two you're talking about. Yeah. I was hoping it was me. <laughs> well, uh, a death match will decide. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so we, yeah, we hung out. We went out to eat and sat outside at this socially distanced restaurant. And the food was so good. But the How flies, good was it? The flies drove me freaking crazy. Yeah, that's It's like as soon as the it. food came out, like the flies were just everywhere. So I'd, I'd like scarf a, scarf a bite and then like put it on my plate and put my napkin over. I'm like, these. Uh-huh. Mother loving flies. I almost lost my mind. No, you should just eat with a bag over your head. <laughs> Better idea. And had the the burger under. Yeah. And when I pull that's it, exactly. I have a mask on. No one can see my beard. You could do it like the horses do. Just put like put the hamburger feed inside drop. a little feed bag. A feed bag <laughs> on the face. <laughs> Who says I didn't do it that way? I think you just did. Oh well, right. okay. now you know. Uh, I'm, fr- I'm hungry now, man. Ooh, me too, wee. actually. I didn't get a snack between this, so this story I is did. making me really hungry. Dinner. Uh, so it was it we it was a good time. We didn't just eat; we played games and we hung out and we laughed and made fun of Jason. So. That's yeah, that sounds about so, right. Yeah, that's what yeah. we do <laughs> in the most loving way possible. Mm. I cannot wait to get there, and because I'll be there in October, Not I long. cannot wait to get there and play a fresh game of Horpins. Wow. Mm. My body's my body's ready. An OG oh, I, game of Horpins. I destroyed Shane. Did you? Horpins. Oh yeah. We'll save it. Save it. Save it for the well, How podcast. long do you want to save it for? It's fine. No, shoot it's, these fly, we, shoot we these podcast flies out of here. Get off, get off of my shoot, shoot. Shoot. about what we've been shoot. playing. Are you gonna spoil it? Well it's yeah, kinda was, I was waiting. That's fine. We can we can wrap around the horn. Do you want to talk about a cat? Yeah. Yes. Huh? Well, we get we have a, we have a new. That cat. was a weird swerve. I do for want anybody. to talk about. Well, it. you were talk. We almost talked about it before, and you guys said wait because you want you want to talk about it here. Aaron went I to the park. Question. Aaron went to the park with the kids, and under the slide, cowering was this <laughs> this kitten, and uh-huh. nearby was a pile of food that someone probably just threw on the ground nearby. So we're pretty sure this cat's abandoned. Super sweet. The kids want to call the cat Minerva. It's a girl. Oh, did no, you try the food? That's not going to work for me. Did you try the food first just to make sure it was for the cat? I was here. I didn't try it. Oh. Um, well, see, it's, it's a Harry Potter. We have we have Remus uh-huh. yeah. from Harry Potter. We have Minerva. No. Well, we'll, do a, we'll do a poll Let's see. on yeah. Twitter to see if people want that. Um, they've already named we, it, and they, they yelled it to me. So we have We have a different name that we would like to submit. To the internet because What's this that? is how things get done. Okay, Kathy, Kathy Warmbier. Oh, yeah, <laughs> but it's a, it's and we'll call him Cat for short. Cat, Cat Warmbier. Well, it's yeah, a girl. Write that down. It's a problem. Oh, him's a she. Yeah, even better. Kathy Warmbier. What's how about Catherine? Catherine. Yeah, Catherine. Catherine Warmbier. Okay, I'll try to put that on the Twitter. Well, so the cat's right now in my bedroom. C A T dash Thrin. Cat, 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 
attack you. <laughs> Get in here. <laughs> um, so I don't. I am fine with having another cat, but I guess you know well, we have good. to. Yeah, because we're probably going to lose a chicken. So you know, kind of like you replace the balance. One for one. one. I yep, really one wanted to one. ask about that, but I didn't know if you'd be too upset. I'm actually okay. So one of our I don't chickens think Matt is, would be too upset. <laughs> just... My kids are. Well, some of my kids are. Um, they don't listen. One, it's fine. one of our chickens is probably egg locked, which egg, means that egg an bound. egg is egg bound. That's it. A little, an egg is locked in their gullet. It's not uh, in the gullet. I'm I know, so sorry. The gullet of their stomach. Did you do uh, what I man. suggested for you to do? Yeah, to check to see if there was an egg stuck. We we felt around. You can't really. You don't see anything. If you could, you could pull it out. But we didn't see anything. So no, it's, it's but did you? I told you to put a glove on your hand and no, sort it out. I thought you said put a glove on my head, and I was like, that doesn't make sense. No. <laughs> so he yeah. did it Come naturally. Cha. Come with the job. Come with the job. Chachi, chachi. So, yeah, the chicken is just kind of like moping around the yard, wandering around the yard, trying to lay an egg, but it won't happen. So, Aaron has soaked mm. said chicken in Epsom salt yep. a couple the times. The whole chicken? Well, just like the, the lower part, half, the lower part. half, yeah. In <laughs> the southern Florida. hemisphere, trying yeah. to you know, because yeah. if, if you want to be relaxed, this egg can can pass, and if it doesn't pass, and if they're screwed, should go to the big pasture in the sky, big yep. hen house in the sky. Yep. <laughs> it's sad when you first when we first were talking about that. Bubba was laughing at this poor chicken. It's still I I'm I'm not laughing at like a You're chicken l- is about to. <laughs> is not long for this world it's all of the circumstance around it the thing that I it's know. called like all of that <laughs> is, is funny That's stuff just what to me. it's called it's one of our it's one of our lavender orpingtons too so it's like one of the prettier ones yeah those are really pretty mm. but you know what i don't know actually i don't know what sorry for your future loss maybe if it happens we'll see uh, we're hoping she's kind of been a little bit more mobile today but um, yeah still nothing well, just keep me updated, you know. Oh, for sure. You'll be the first to know. Don't, don't worry about keeping Bubba in the loop about it. It's, yeah, I'm fine. No, I want him, no. It's pointless. I, want I mean, him. I want to officiate the the funeral, but. Oh, well, we don't what? Care. You didn't offer to do that for my dead chicken. Well, well the, he's I feel more connected before. to this one. I'm, yeah, I'm, he's oh. met these chickens before. What's I've this met one's this name? Chi- What's this one's name? Uh, Purple. This is La- Purple. Lavender Brown. Oh, Lavender, Lavender Brown. Brown. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Well, like from Harry Potter. All, all of our right. names are from Harry Potter. Is Lavender Brown from Harry Potter? Yeah. What is sure that is. in Harry Potter? It's one of the girls, ladies. Her name is Lavender Brown? <laughs> one of the girls, yeah. ladies. That's girls terrible. Ladies. Hey, talk to JK. No, it's Done. cute. I already, I already messaged her. Well, it's, it's yeah, it's fine. She's it's, in some my, hot water right now, so she- My message just says, this better not happen ever again. <laughs> yeah, okay, pass. She just sent a thumbs up. Who dis? <laughs> yeah. Who body? New Potter. Who body, Who body dis? Um, did we get through all of the random stuff? We talked about the cat. We talked about oh, the chicken. Oh, no, we didn't. No, we didn't. You're back. The back to important. the cat. No, you're back. Oh, my back. <laughs> yep, yep, back we're back to the, to the chicken. Go back to the cat. <laughs> um, no, you're yeah. back. You got bent, literally. <laughs> it's you so brought this so on yourself. You like, brought this, this on yourself. We almost skipped it, this part. Did I? Yeah, because you were always telling other people to get bent, and then oh, you, you yourself got <laughs> bent. I put a hex on me. You did. Oh man! Straight to your oh. ninth vertebrate. Yeah, well, I don't know how many. Uh, it, it's straight to enough of them. That's for sure. Um, mm-hmm. and so basically, what ended up happening was. <laughs> Sorry. We. <laughs> I haven't even started my story know, yet. You're already laughing at me. It's funny. <laughs> Pretend I'm one of your precious chickens, Kate, and I'm just throwing my back out. All right. <clears throat> yeah. Can you get a glove yeah. on? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you better not <laughs> put it away. Uh, on um, your head. Oh put a glove on your head. Put it on your head. Yeah, you put it on your head That's and we're so going to go. <laughs> so we just, we, we recorded uh, an episode of Church Nerds and oh, in order, oh, no, 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 it wasn't Church Nerds. It was, we Nerds. were covering for you guys on Co-Optional. That's what it was. Stream, yeah. And so we, we had to put all of the, the crossbar up and the camera over the top and all that jazz. And like none of this is labor intensive. Not any of it is. And so I'm tearing all this down. After the fact, this is Monday, this is Labor Day, and Anna says, right. hey, can I, can I get to, yeah, right, can I get to the, the washer and dryer, please? And I was like, oh, yeah, I know that makes sense. I'm sorry. I meant to do it earlier. So I take it, I take most of it down, and I'm like, I legitimately bent over to put it under the, the little, in the cubby hole where it goes, and my back just went, not today, <laughs> sucker, 
and it it got real tight all the way did you around. Fall over. I almost, I almost did. <laughs> I I went down on one knee. I for sure did. <laughs> T-boat it. Yeah, t- I had to. Oh what do you want gosh. me to do? Not T-boat it? Like I don't. <laughs> you know. There's like a tear in my eye right now. Uh, <laughs> see, <laughs> Bubba laughs at the chickens. You laugh at Bubba. Okay, I swear. That's that's not even the funniest part of the whole thing. Oh. I wish. I wish I could have had somebody filming me because it would have been Kate Katawaki gold. <laughs> I mean, like anytime you felt down, you just pop that little sucker in the VCR oh and you'd have been good to go. Wouldn't it be VCR? on like DVD or Blu-ray? N- no. no. It, it, it'd be a VHS tape, oh, okay. obviously. Uh, the micro one you had to put in the converter. <clears throat> yes, absolutely. Yeah, I, Well, I'd film, film it on the mini DVD, absolutely. Mm, yeah. And so, um, like I, 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 I talked about this on stream and kind of showed, but like I have this, I have a DX racer chair, a, a nerd chair, and they lay all the way back for reasons that are unknown to me. For but they do stuff, it. you wouldn't know. Yeah, you would say you wouldn't, I'll tell you when you get older. And so it leans all the way back, <laughs> and um, I have this like raised, it, it's it's almost like a, like a little folding desk. Yeah, just like uh-huh. that, man. It's like a folding desk, and so I can, I can set the pitch of it, of the head. And so what I did was well, I had my, my keyboard in my lap, I had that leaned all the way back, and I had my, my mouse on that thing and then that was like my my desk area for about the, two minutes did you have the the mouse tied to anything in case you dropped it no that would have <laughs> yeah that would have been bad i should have tied to my wrist Anna. yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, well they were going to the lake that day and mm, yeah. i say they up until that point i was also going to the lake i was yeah. going to be riding jet skis um, were, that you were <laughs> and i was kind of mad about not being able to do that uh, long story short with the jet skis, jet skis were broken. So I oh, think that then. Lord was looking out for me on that one. Um, and so anyway, I, I laid back for about two minutes, maybe less than that. And was like, this is just not going to n- n- no. And so I had Anna bring me a heating pad. And so I put a, I had a heating pad on my back for about an hour. That sounds nice. And then it was like, well, I got to go to the bathroom. So I was like, I'll just get up and go to the bathroom. Right? Anna never- catheter me. Never <laughs> thrown my back out before. If you've never thrown your back out before, one does not simply get up and go to the bathroom. Um, y- you, if you can even get up, you might make it halfway, maybe, before you fall over. Not before you, you pee or poop yourself, but that might happen too. Mm-hmm. I was like hobbling and I, like my legs didn't work. And anytime I put any pressure on anything, I was like falling down <laughs> and I was literally... To, to get from one uh, spot to the other. Have you ever had to move like a filing cabinet without a dolly? Yeah. No. You know how it kind of, it, you'll either like waddle back and we forth wobble, wobble, or you'll yeah. spin it. Yeah. Wobble, I was baby, the spin. Wobble, baby, wobble, baby, wobble. Yeah. I was the spin version of the file cabinet. And mm. so I was just like uh, turning and spinning did, around. Just tell me Anna recorded this somewhere. No, she was like on her way out. And she's, I, I think, I think a large part of her thought I was faking it. Yeah. Well, you, uh-huh. I was not. Fine now. I was not well. So here's the deal. Well, you've had the man flu in the past. I, that's so. what she thought. That's what she said on Facebook. She was like, "I thought he maybe was just like man sick," um, and honestly, I thought maybe that was it too. And then it happened at like ten. We were supposed to leave at like one or two, and I was like, "We'll see at about two o'clock if I'm good to go." And at eleven thirty, I was like, "I'm not going to the lake. It's just not going to happen because I think I'm dead. I think I've just died." And Dying it was heaven. It's well, not heaven. Nope, not the, <laughs> not the good place. That's for sure. Um, and so, anyway, long story short, uh, we have physical therapists in our several physical therapists in our in our family. And Anna's aunt told me basically to get down and do a girl push up or a series of girl push ups. And she said that it like it it pushed the bulging disc back into place. And that sounded like way worse than it actually was because like a bulging disc is that's like a problem yeah yeah this was like something had compressed and needed to be like popped out Mm. so i did a long stretch with my back some low-key yoga popped it out and then was able to do the girl push-up to to kind of compress everything back in well i hope you you learned your lesson and here i am here's no here's the lesson is that i can't wait you once laughed at me for sitting down on the couch and my knee popping out and going back in. 
Well, and I really think, and you know, multiple people said this in the in on your Facebook post when you said it that it might, you know, been karma for what you <laughs> for what you laughed at when I sat I down on the couch. I stand by my <laughs> laughter in that. One hundred percent, I do, um, because I, I just think that it's going to happen. Period. Okay, and that was a very hilarious situation for both you and I. So I, I then went on, uh, and all this is documented on Facebook. I, I went on a couple of different posts, and I asked people, "Hey, how have you thrown your back out?" Oh, I saw and that. And I got really the good. most ridiculous stuff, and I want to share just a few of them. Yeah, 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 picking up a three right. Dorito. Yeah. <laughs> so my favorite is, uh, I think it was Craig Falvo. I think it was it, Falvo who said that he woke up and his back was out. He just like <laughs> sleeping threw his back out. <laughs> um, and Sorry, Craig. Uh, you know, there was there was another person that was like, I was just reaching up to get something off of a top shelf, and then I I turned around and threw my back out. And one of my other favorites was somebody said that they knew an MMA fighter who just like was going. I mean, was a legit <clears throat> muscle of a human being got beat up and beat up other people for a living, right? Yeah. Um, and then threw his back out, like putting on his shoes or something like oh that. And I was like, D- here's the deal. If that guy throws his back out, there is no hope for me. Yeah. I feel true. pretty good about my life so far. It Have you not thrown happened? it out? No. Never had it before. Well, Ooh, knock on wood. You better not. Here we have the voodoo mama juju. King Tut's fine. curse. Here we go. I, think, I feel fine. No, well, I already can't curse said you. Too before you know. No, I my my back's so stressed, my body's so stressed that it, it just keeps all the muscles tight together, so yeah. my back can't go anywhere. <laughs> You're welcome, buddy. You know what I think that it was. <laughs> so I was playing, I was playing Tanner Honk, mm-hmm. and I was in one of the skate parks. It was the first one in Tony Hawk Pro Skater One, where you have to you have to do the competition, and I forget what it's called. Oh, yeah, it doesn't really like matter. Burnside or something like that. Not Burnside, the one before that. Okay. So it's the one where it's indoors. Um, and so anyway, um, I'm going and I'm I'm trying to 100% all these levels. So I want to get all the stat points and I want to yeah. get all the logos. Ambitious. Yep. <laughs> well, I want to I want to I want to get this game Gotta and I want to get the full yeah, full effect. And so you have to you have to like vault off of the back side of this this half pipe. And then you have to grind a rail that's up on top. And then you have to jump, grind the next rail, and then jump and grind the next rail to get the logo. Mm-hmm. And even familiar. just getting up there yeah, I just did that yesterday in my life. is hard. Like, it's it's legit hard. It's like Tony Hawk hard. And do you so, do it boneless? Always. <laughs> okay. Yeah. If, well, hey. if I would have done a boneless, I wouldn't have thrown my back out, you know? That's right. <laughs> um, now you say it. And so... I wanted to get up there, and so I find. I mean, no joke. We took like forty-five minutes for me to get this stupid thing, um, and in doing so, I was like, "Oh, I'm going to do some celebratory squats." So I've got some room here in my no, my streaming didn't. area. I did. I did twenty squats, <laughs> and when I and when I finished that, I was like, "Hmm, my back doesn't feel super great. Maybe I should have stretched." And like for the next two days. I felt like it started to get tighter and tighter and tighter. And I guess it just there was like, hey, man, game over, bro. Well, so Tony Hawk threw your back out. Basically. is what uh, I'm, yeah, Anthony I, Hawk to you, Kate. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Yeah, I don't know. His friends well. call him Tony. You yeah. can call him Anthony. Oh. So, uh, yeah, I, I'm going to sue him. Right, <laughs> Probably good. wise, yeah. yeah. Like, hey, you, either the box. Do, you either do a 900 or I'm suing you. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> I know you're 53 years old. No, I saw he did one recently. He did one recently. So he did. Well, it was yeah. his body double. Well, it was. His remember, double. remember in Coachella when they had Tupac play <laughs> on the hologram? Yeah, it was the, the same thing. It was like that. Yeah. Thing, yeah. Actually, it was oh. Tupac that did the 900. And Tupac, Tupac did the 900 <laughs> dressed, dressed in the Birdman gear. Yep, dressed in the Birdman gear. Oh my god. Birdman, Harvey Birdman. It's ridiculous. Hey, speaking of uh, Harvey Birdman, Kate, what have you been yeah. playing? Well, um, not. Uh, what was his name? Anthony Hawk. Tanner Hawk. Yeah. 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 Huh? Anthony Hawkerman. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I haven't been playing that. Um, <laughs> I, <laughs> okay. I've actually I had just started this game on our last episode. It's called Spirit Fairer. Um, I ended up finishing it Congrats. this past weekend. Oh, you beat it. 
I <coughs> spit went down the wrong way. <clears throat> okay. I didn't know it was a game that you could beat. But I apparently, appar- I didn't it. know. I thought it was kind of one of those endless, like procedurally generated, kind of like quest things. Oh, okay. I just, I, I didn't. I guess I read something and and didn't read it correctly. Where I thought that it just kind of went and went and went, kind of like Stardew Valley. It just goes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's not the case. There is a main storyline that you can complete, and I completed it. So I'm really proud of you. How many games is that you've beaten this year? A bunch more than you. So I think. thought, yeah, oh, barely, um, yeah, barely. Do, you, do tabletop games count? No. Wait, so you, oh, okay. you so you beat Spirit Fair, you I beat s- Ghost of Tsushima, yeah, you beat something um, else, something before that. I oh, the remember. the one with the lady that that looks like um, oh Control, like Control. There, I'll Control. I did that. I don't know. I'd have to really sit down and Detroit go through. I'll count. I'll count one of your no. Red Deads. No, I. Well, I guess you could count. Okay, yeah, we'll you count. count one. I'll count. count I'll one. give you one. one of them. I've beaten like a bunch of games this year. Mm-hmm. Um, the thing is, is that I got I bought a game called Persona Five. Yeah. That I was Persona going to play. Persona Non Grata. Yeah. Secondhand. And yeah. it, uh, I was all excited because it's like, oh, it's a hundred hour game. You know, it's one of those ones you really get get into. Ryan Garrow is really hyped on it. Should have been your first red flag. Yeah, it should have been mm. because it is stressful. I can't, I stopped playing it because I'm like, this is too much. Honestly, I like a lot of stuff and like long drawn out stories, all this stuff, but this is too much. <laughs> I'm tired. I'm tired and I cannot. I, Surprising from you. Exactly. Yeah. So like there's this whole like castle thing that you have to get through. You feeling like, okay? I don't know. Maybe I have the Corona. You can't say that you're going to get demonetized. Well, Clausen just beeped that out. Um, or monetize this first, and then we'll worry about it. Later. Or, yeah. Or okay. There it is. There yeah. it is. I I think instrument. I've I think I've met my match in a game that is like too long, too story, too much. In Persona. Yes. No. Okay. I don't think I can get through it, and I haven't even made it through one like Kate. palace dungeon thing. I'm at the beginning, and I'm so irritated by it, and. It just caused me a lot of stress. I don't need a lot more stress in my life. That's why I put that down and I picked up Spirit Fair and I beat that. And, and my beat switch <laughs> my switch said twenty five hours or more. So couldn't get through one dungeon in Persona. Okay, 5 no, 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 but it takes a lot. Spirit no, Fair. no, no, no. It takes a lot to get to that dungeon and to even start. And then you have to do it in multiple like days, in game days. And I'm just like, Oh my gosh. Let's just get through this. Why do you I th- drag it out? Like let's just get it done. Like I think that we need to we need to like come up with games for you to play and beat. No, no, I already know what I'm going to play after this one. What? I I already started. I started the Tomb Raider uh, Rise of the Tomb Raider, I think. That's it fine. Was, you blow it through was free. that. So I started both of those to see which one I was going to do. I said, "Oh, I'll play Persona 5, put 10 hours in Persona 5, I'm dying." So I want you to play the 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 it's like that dungeon crawler where you have to date your weapons. Do you know what, which one I'm talking about? I have no idea what you're talking about, Matt. You know what I'm talking about. We saw it at we saw it at a convention. Don't look at me like that. You know what I'm no, talking about. No, Matt to, doesn't know. It doesn't exist. It, it, it's vaguely ringing a bell. Okay, you keep talking. I'm gonna get that. No, get the you're probably talking about um that pigeon one. No, the pigeon game. No, no that's I, not what it is. I boyfriend gonna, dungeon. Mm. Oh right, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, I'll look it up. Is it on Switch or what? It's on Steam. Mm. Why not on Switch? Uh, well, I just clicked it's, on the Steam link. It's gone. Here, I'll do further research. No, well, I'm gonna play Tomb Raider after I pull it together a little bit. Um, it just was stressing me out a little bit as well. I'm not really in the mood to be stressed, extra stressed. So. Let's see, what's today? We're in like middle of September. So Assassin's Creed Valhalla comes out November 10. So I have to keep yeah, myself yeah. occupied until November 10. That's, and I'm, I get that. I fully understand. It. And I'm trying to help you get there. Well, you know, if hey, anybody you know, has you, Persona 5 tips for me, I will, could I will gladly hear them. It just caused me, it, it was just an overwhelming experience. And, you know, people are shouting in the game. They're like, eh. What? Okay, you, you know what you could do? Just play Red Dead. 
I could do that, but I'm trying really hard not to for the yeah, sanity well. of the people that listen to this podcast. Hey, I'm fine. I, I want did. About, I want. I, I did want to know about the new for. things you find. I know there still are new things to be found in that game. Oh, yeah, I am is. watching. I was going to text you about this earlier, and I forgot. You know how people on YouTube make like movies where they put all the cut scenes of a game together and then you watch it like a movie? Uh-huh. Yeah, I've heard of movies before, yeah. Well, this is different than movies. <laughs> and this is oh, much better. This is a much better movie alternative. So I've been rewatching Red Dead One. And yeah. The cut scenes. Yeah, it's almost four hours long. Oh yeah. Wow. It's really good. You should watch it. I'm picking up on a lot more details this time. Okay. After well, the first send me, time. Send me a link. Played it. Yeah, well, we'll see if you have what it takes. I'll just watch it tonight. On, I mean, on last Monday on stream. Yeah. <laughs> it says Red Dead Redemption 1, all cutscenes movie, 4K, 60 FPS, enhanced 4K? edition. 4K? You think I had that kind of money around here? Jeez. Yeah. So anyways, that's... Uh, that's all right, I'll watch it. Watch you should them. pick up... You should... Well, not you two, but you listeners should pick up Spirit Bearer if you're into like a little bit more chill, much I'm less I'm watching grindy. Frost play it. Yeah, much frostplane. much less grindy than Stardew Valley. It has a different flavor, so it's really I really enjoyed that game, and I almost wasn't going to get it again. If you have Xbox Game Pass, it's on there for freezies. Yeah, sure, do that. Mom, I need my Xbox. <laughs> uh, I I have decided that that is not the game for me. I've watched no, it. No, that's what that's why I excluded you from when it's I said cute. you should get it. It's definitely a Kate it. game for sure. It's Kate, you don't know my game. life. Yeah. Okay, you, p- you pick it up and we'll see how long you play it for. I'm bored play, already. I'm yeah. play Anthony Hawk. <laughs> Ackerman. <laughs> Anthony Hawkerman. Uh, yeah. yeah. So what have you been playing? Matt. You talking to me? Matthew. Matthew Matt. Matthew. Well, Shane uh, was in town like we mentioned earlier. Oh, really? And, was, I, yeah, I, I know. hadn't heard. I had barely heard. And uh, <laughs> several, several, several months ago, he said, hey, I'm at Target and Clask is on super sale. Yes. Did you want me to pick it up for you? And I was like, oh, how, thoughtful. Uh, how much? And he's like, $17. I was like, $17? yes, please. $17. $17. Bubba almost fell out of his chair or he almost laid it out. I don't know. Yeah, be sure careful with your bag. That now. game was $100 at one point. I know. Well, not I got, anymore. I got it for um, $17.48. Dude, congrats. <laughs> I know. Was it the two player or the four player? The two player. Oh, okay. I'll allow hey, it. come on. I, I'll allow it. I'll allow it. So we played a ton. Yes. A ton. Uh, and we watched some videos of the championships, watched the winning shot. Because you can't uh, not, right? Yeah, you got to know. I got to know how I can get better. So it jumped from like zero plays to like my number two played <laughs> tabletop game this year. Only uh. Marvel Champions has more plays. Uh, so... If you have not played Clask, Freaking if you do not, if do you don't it. know what I'm talking about here, uh, you can number one either just type it in K L A S K in your search bar there. Okay. Or I can just tell you, think um, think air hockey hmm? without the air. Well, there's you still have, air, but it, yeah, it's not pumped in. Oh, this is interesting. Look at this. So it's, you, you could. It's still expensive. It's still fifty bucks. Yeah, well, it's that, nice bump. unless I, you I get it on paper. super super sale three months or five months ago uh so you have a you have a little pawn type shooter on top of the table that you control with a magnet by holding it underneath the table you kind of Mm -hmm. move around and you're bumping this ball back and forth trying to get into the your opponent's little circle goal everything is wooden except for your little ball right and then well and then there's also these three little what they call biscuits that are also magnetized yeah biscuits yeah you gotta risk it you risk it. So, if you get your if you get the ball into your opponent's little hole, you get a point. <laughs> if you get uh, these little biscuits, two of these little biscuits connected to you, your opponent gets a point, or vice versa. Uh-huh. Um, so it's just like. And then also, if you get th- so you're trying to get them not into a net or not to go through the back. There's a little indentation on your right. side. That the that the ball has to go into. So if your if your person like your uh, what'd you call it, your bumper that your yeah, like your pawn that you're thing, if yeah. if you're controlling that and you pull yourself into your own goal, yeah, then they also get clask. a point. And also, if you get if you lose control of your person yeah. on the other side and you can't get it back because there's a divider under the thing, 
then they get a point as well. Yeah, it's easy to fling your 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 so pawn easy. forward. So it has to be a controlled hit. Yeah, but you're trying to like you want to hit it decently hard. Oh, of course, the, the ball. <laughs> um, so if you're able to play it, play it. This thing is is huge. Came out in 2013, and it's just continued to grow ever since. Like Bubba said, there is a four player circular variant. I got it. It's right there. Yeah, Bubba hasn't even opened it yet. I haven't. <laughs> it's still in the box. Yeah, I was with him when he bought it. Uh, <laughs> but I had to have it. Man, How many you, times do we go back to that stupid? You've booth? said that a lot. a lot about a lot of games, Bubba. What you, I stand it's by it's it. probably too big for you to bring, purchase. isn't it? Del Con. Mm. It's probably too big. It's a big box, bro. It's a big box. Well, with that attitude. Um, yeah. So we played just a ton I'll see what of I that. Can do. All right, no, no pressure here. Uh, played a ton of that. Uh, taught him how to play root. I played against Aaron and Shane and uh, lost miserably. I was a vagabond, just. Not even close. Couldn't get what I needed. Had to keep retreating back to the forest to uh, <laughs> refresh my items. Uh, and we also played Tiny Towns. Hey, uh, did you play and, the expansion? Yes, we did. And the expansion's great. Hey. The whole game is great. I, you like you play these games and you, you put them on your shelf and you kind of forget about them and you bring them back out and you're like, man, why did I stop playing this game? It's yeah. so good. Yeah. Uh, Bubba, is that how you feel about Yukon Salon? It's kind actually, of actually. Know, it's... It's right there. I just took it out of a box like yesterday. What? Boom roasted. Yeah, so that I could play it. Oh no, you didn't get the. No, no I didn't. We're still getting up. I didn't. Though. I didn't That's steal <laughs> the box. I went and looked for it. We've had this conversation before. Yep. I didn't looked happen. for it at the uh, PAX um, tabletop experience area. Yeah. Well, there's there was that new update from uh, whoever's taking yeah. that project now. Oh, is it AE? They basically said, "Hey, we looked at the Photoshop files and they look good." Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Command P. Yeah, all is it not Alderac? I thought it was Alderac that was doing it. No. Oh, uh, I don't think so. I'll look it up right now. You can look it up. Uh No. That game's Atlas coming. Games. Atlas there Games. I was close. Mm, yeah, sort of. Pretty much the same thing. Uh but we also played beyond those three just a ton of Tony Hawk Pro Skater. One and two. Remastered because the game's just fun and it's so know, good. It makes you feel like you're you're living out your late nineties, early two thousand youth mm, when yeah. you're just an old washed up has been. <laughs> <laughs> Speak for yourself. I remember those uh, days. Yeah, so hey, we just how, played some of that. How far are you in the game, like actual game? Uh I have probably I need another gold trophy. In that whatever that first indoor one is, I haven't got. I didn't get, not get a gold there. I got a silver. Okay. I need to get a gold trophy at Roswell. I got ripped off. I got freaking <laughs> ripped off. Oh, uh, and then I have like a couple six scores to get. I think that's it. Like I'm, I'm pretty dang close. I have all the secret tapes. Oh, for, for uh, Tony Hawk one. Yes, Tony Hawk one. Tony okay. Hawk two. I'm probably about halfway through the levels, but not like anything super hard. Oh, so you're just like skipping around. I decided to go to Tony Hawk 2 just because I I had played uh, a lot okay. of Tony Hawk 2 and I was like I just want to like want to you know see what I remember here. And then I got mm, to the school 2 and I was like oh, I hate this place. The school. The school 2. Yeah. School again. Uh, I I had to look one thing up in school 2. It I was... had to look up one thing in school one. I couldn't find the last freaking bell on the oh, wall really? ride. It was on top of that dang building. Yeah, the I had to look The building I wasn't up. going to. Yeah. Yep. There's just some things I don't remember how to do. It was the gaps, the grind gaps. Oh yeah, there's some. The one where you have to like you have to grind it all the way up and then do a a, a wall plant and then grind it all the way back down. Uh, I thought yeah. I did that, and I di- actually I did, but I didn't grind enough of it. Like I started my grind too late. And so mm. it didn't register it. And I was like, what is going on with this Get freaking you every game? time. So. Um, yeah, super fun game. If you like Tony Hawk way back when, it's time to get back into it. It be- really is. You. He calls to you. Game is so gorgeous. It's yep. beautiful. It's butter smooth. So wow. great. Yeah, I know. Okay, it's your next, it's your next uh, like, quick hit game. Like, you only have a few minutes to play. Maybe. No, no maybes. Trust me. Okay, I've not steered you steered you wrong here. What? I haven't ever steered you wrong <laughs> in games. Yeah, so every sentence. game I told you to do, you've played, and then you're like, "Oh, you're right. This is so good." So I'm just... I can think of one. 
game. 100 games. 100 games. What do you mean one game? What else besides Red Dead did you suggest? <laughs> that other game that we talked about when we played. I don't know. Don't even Ghost remember of Tsushima? Ghost? God of yeah. War? No, no, no. You Animal no. Crossing? Tombs Raider? I already knew about that. No. I don't know. Uh, we'll think about it later. There was other games though. You weren't you weren't in, and then you played them. You're like, okay, you're right. Spirit Fair. No, um, not that one. Cooking Mama. No. Corey in the House. No. Yep, Definitely, that's, that's it. Um, that's it. Mm-hmm. Corey in the House. MDS. Yep. Others, others games too. Yep. Oh, well, I'll from. think about it, Kate. Hey, Bubba, I'd love to know what you've been playing. Not mm-hmm. Kate. She doesn't want to. Know. Uh, I do. Yeah, I don't want to know. Nothing. I have been playing a lot. He's been playing Bent Back. Bent Back. <laughs> Matt called me the the other day and he was like, "Hey, how's Brookback going?" And I was like, <laughs> that was pretty funny. That's that was great. pretty funny. Brookback, that's pretty funny. Bubba, that's a new nickname for um, you right there. Yeah, just Matt, like well, Boo Boo Bam Bam, whatever that. <laughs> well, yeah. Okay. Hey, Kate, why don't you just go play Tomb Raider? Um, <laughs> it's uh, I've been playing a lot of Destiny Two. I mean, a lot of Destiny Two. Probably when I should be doing other things. It's not like even in my free time. I'm just oh, like. Did Frost get you into it? Yeah, yeah. he absolutely did. <laughs> and so, so we've been playing quite a bit, and I've had a chance to play with him, with Falvo, with MDB, um, and uh, played with Ibsen. It's it's really good to get back into playing with other people <laughs> because I was legitimately in the middle of nowhere and I couldn't play with anybody for the longest time. And so now being able to play with other people, I like games more and I'm playing more games with other people, but have been playing a lot of Destiny and we've got a a clan going. You guys should get in and girls, you nerds should get in. (laughs) I'm learning. I'm learning. I'm learning friends here. Guys, Um, Give me some grace. Just Uh, those guys. But if you go to lovethynerd.com slash discord you can get into our server and then from there you can find the destiny 2 area that we have there's a little category in there and it has our tower chat and it also has pve voice and also pvp voice channels for you to get into and we also have a clan chat so we have a tower chat and a clan chat for two reasons there are some people that are just in awesome clans already and that's cool we want you to still be able to hang out and raid with us and do all sorts of stuff but for clans, like you have to get in there and do actual clan stuff to level your clan up. So, um, yeah, get in there, check it out. There are some people that are getting back into it. Some are like really on the fence about it. I say now is the time. If you now have Xbox, if you got Xbox Game Pass, it's a part of Xbox Game Pass. You heard it here, people. Now's the time. Now's the time. <laughs> and also, Beyond Light, the new DLC that's coming out is also dropping day one on Xbox Game Pass. So, Mm. like, they have... Bungie has signed another deal with Microsoft. And so they got that Halo money again. And they can just do all kinds of stuff. And I am so glad it's not a PlayStation exclusive anymore. Didn't make a lot of sense for it to be a PlayStation exclusive because... Bungie used to be a Microsoft company, so like... Hey, you know um, what? Donkey Kong used to be with Nintendo, but then Rare stole them. Yeah. Okay. And now they're... Well, I guess they still... Nintendo owns Donkey. It, that's yeah. weird. That's a weird one. Yeah. That's a weird one. Um, But, yeah, I've been playing a lot of that, and then obviously um, just freaking Tanner Honk. Every now All and again, that. just mm-hmm. jump in, grind some stuff out. I'll probably be Literally. playing that tomorrow night, as a matter of fact. Um, so I'm pretty excited about that. Yeah, we need to start thinking about what games we're playing next year because I don't have a ton of time left in Ghost. I've been kind of slow. We'll on see. Better. Yeah, I read somewhere or someone told me that you were going to get the new Assassin's Creed. Oh yes, Matt. It's actually supposed to come with your computer. I'm sorry. What? Which one? Assassin's Creed? <laughs> the, la, new, la, la, la. the new Assassin's Creed. And let me say this: you better have a good attitude about it. So it came. It actually came with your graphics card. So you should have it. On. He doesn't want to play it. Give it to me. That's very, that's very actually, interesting. No, I'm already going to pre-order it. Doesn't matter. Oh, I don't want it. That's interesting yours. too. Oh, hey, you know what I'm playing? <laughs> I already know what I'm playing next. What? Oh, I'm, I know what I'm playing. Mario. I've, I yeah, I pre-ordered the oh, 3D yeah. Mario All Stars. 
I have been saying, and I you can go back and check the tape because it's on there. I have been saying for years the Mario game that I want is Super Mario Sunshine. Give it to me on I've Switch. I've said that as well, but I don't want the other two. Here, so why well, don't I do. For the other Got them anyway. Yeah. I, I think bonus. I don't want them. I, just, I think you're going to you're going to want Galaxy. Galaxy mm-hmm. is a great game. Galaxy's fun. It is a great game. I'll consider it maybe with my if I find another birthday money gift card or something. It's like all that. together. If I know, if but you, I don't I just wish it was separate so that I could get not. one. I don't want the other two. Well, I here's the deal. Mario's you have got to make a decision by March because it goes away. Well, I have some time then. Even so, then, the so what does that edition. mean? What is the, I guess this is another podcast episode, but what? W- wait a second. It means I'm terrified. I don't so, know. You I said don't know. even the digital edition. So does that mean that if you buy it digitally, then they take it away? I don't Why? think so. I think I think that I you still so. have it. It's just not purchasable. I need to. I need verification that if I uninstall it. I can reinstall oh. it. Oh, Clausen, you'll be please fine. Please help us, Clausen. Can you just interject here? We'll you'll be fine. Through. No, I think you'll be fine because once you purchase it, you, even if you delete it from your your library, you can still read. Well, you never it. know these days unless do you? they take it out of the the library area or however Nintendo no, does. That I stuff. think you're ever thinking this. I don't want to underthink it. Know. That's for sure. Yeah, then you'd look, you know, foolish. Fact that's of the matter: cool. I've already paid for it, and I think okay. that what they're doing is like somebody had mentioned that. They've got N64 titles like coming, and it's very apparent that that's true. We did we had Doom 64, which almost nobody played, but the the thing of it is is that it was there. It was on the Switch, and you can get it. Yeah. Okay, so that was the first, you know, <clears throat> N64 title, and now we have Super Mario. But what they're also showing us is that GameCube games are also and Wii games are also able to work just fine on the switch so that really just explodes the library that you could possibly have of games Mm -hmm. that are playable on the switch so i think that's why they're doing the limited release is so that they can get more money out of us later kind of a probably probably maybe i highly doubt that they that they just add like you know they have, you know, the Nintendo Online for the NES games and the SNES games that they just are like, oh, hey, here's N64 and GameCube. And here's also, you know, like, uh, you know, what's the other one? Wii and Wii U. I don't think they're going to do that. But I well, think that they will be available. How about a Zelda Wind Waker? <gasps> Again? Okay. Do you want to do you want to do that right now? No, no, no I don't. Save no, save no. next week. Okay. No, no. no. Roll right <clears throat> yeah, right. Write that down. I would love to talk about Zelda all day yeah. long. Yeah, mm-hmm. because th- we're in Mario's thirty-fifth right now. They're gonna screw Zelda over. I know they are. I don't think so. I, 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 I don't think it's. I don't think it's gonna have as big a like a, a parade as Mario did. Mm-hmm. But I, I think I think we're gonna be happy with what they do with Zelda. Okay, well, Oops. let's can it. Don't say right. another word. <laughs> Save okay. it for the podcast. We'll save it for a different podcast. I'm trying to write it down. Yeah. Well, those are some of the games that we've been playing and some of the ones that we're looking forward to playing. And I didn't even I didn't even mention Hypnospace Outlaw. I just want to talk about Hypnospace Outlaw all the oh, yeah. time. Sorry, it's save such it next week, a great save game. It, save it. Right, write it down. Write, write it down. down. I'll write it Did down. Did I tell you guys I was playing on like mouse and keyboard on my Xbox? I uh, don't know. No, yeah. but I knew you were playing it. It's fantastic. Like... That's a glorious experience. Okay. Um, anyway. Um, yeah, so hey, if those are some of the games that we've been playing and are looking forward to playing, like I said. And if you want us to play something, let us know. Hit us up on Twitter, at Free Play Podcast, and we will get back at you. And maybe you will turn us on to some new game that we have not even heard of or that we should be playing, but we've kind of put on the back burner because there's no less than 1,000 games that are like that. Yeah, that's um, true. But yeah, hey, I'm so glad to be back with you guys um, and be doing the free play podcast. If you like this, come back each and every Friday. Okay. And okay, Matt, yeah. you good? Are you talking to us or <laughs> who are you talking to? Yeah, I'm only ever talking to you. Guys. I thought it was yeah. us. He's talking I'm to like, me. We're talking to me. Be here. <laughs> yeah, he's talking to me. Yeah, you're welcome. For our listeners. You can oh, also okay. come back. Yeah, each each and every Friday currently. We're, we're, we're kind of tossing around maybe a different release schedule. I don't know. I don't have specifics on that. But if we do move to a Twitch 
um, recording option, then we will probably have to change around when our release schedule is for this podcast. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. We don't know. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. We don't know. But for now, <laughs> it's on Fridays. Or, you know, it's really simple. Just go to lovethynerd.com slash free play and you'll get it whenever it drops. Yeah. Also, if you're not already following us on Twitch, twitch.tv slash love thy nerd, we're there currently six days a week. I say currently because it might be seven. So go hit that follow button and then also hit the bell to be notified when we go live. A lot of people have been saying, oh, well, I didn't I didn't know you were live. We're live basically every day at 8 p.m. Eastern time. Even if you don't get a notification. I think my phone told me that. It should have. Twitch app. (laughs) <laughs> I, I said, don't what's know. This? Yeah. What's this notification? I lit- I didn't know what it was. So <laughs> it just said get bent. Also, it said love thy nerd wow, Twitch somebody. Twitch something, and I was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know I set up notification. Oh thanks well, thanks, that. Kate. Yeah, yeah, you're welcome. I'm really dedicated, as you can much see, much appreciated to a lot of things. <laughs> so yeah, you can go and you can find us there. Um, also, be sure the fit bar. Be sure to check us out <laughs> on SoundCloud. Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Stitcher, Google Play, YouTube, Radio.com, and I don't know, internet places, other, the other spaces. Yeah. The glorious online. Space. Matt, you're right there. The space. <laughs> that was the, the biggest one I've seen from anyone in a really long time. I'm sorry. <laughs> his, his jaw unhinged. Whoa. It was wild. Yeah. Like a snake. You hear my body. <laughs> if you can't find us wherever you listen to podcasts, uh, I don't know what to tell you. Okay. Like I said. Okay. Lovethenerd.com slash free play, and you can click on the RSS button, and then you can make it podcast wherever you want to. If you're not already a part of the Love Thy Nerd Facebook group, do that. If you're a Facebook person, which you are, because I think that when you're born in the United States, you get like a social security number and a Facebook account. Mm-hmm. And so just go ahead and use the second one to log in and then look for us. Love Thy Nerd community. You can request to join, and now I don't even have to approve you. Have I told you guys about uh, this? We, yeah, we have told automatic me. approvals. All you have to do is answer the question, what's up, nerd? If what's you up, guys? answer, if you answer the question, <laughs> you get let in. That's it. We have like 70 something people waiting in the wings. It's because you invited them, and I'm talking to you, listener. You invited them, and you didn't tell them to go and answer the question. So they don't know. Facebook, get it together. Tell people when they've been invited. Send them just a notification a little, or a little something. Notification. It's Anything would be great. Call them on their cellular telephones and let them know what's going on. But if you've invited somebody to our Facebook group, it might be a good idea to just send them a message to let them know that they have to answer the question. Mm-hmm. Other than that, you can head on over to Discord, lovethatnerd.com. I know there how the internet go. works. There you go. Slash Discord. <laughs> and <laughs> you can get in on that. You just, you're going to show, it's going to show another prompt. Hey, here are the guidelines. Click the green check mark at the bottom and boom, roasted, you are in. And I'd love to hang out with you. Matt and I and Frost are pretty advocates, uh, pretty advocates. That's not pretty, a We're very really, pretty. We're very you're, pretty, yes. You're really struggling here. My back's getting sore. He didn't write um, <laughs> I, Yeah, I don't have any of this written down. No, we're, we're pretty big advocates and we're very active in the Discord. So that's you where are. we spend a lot of our time, uh, the three of us. And Kate's in there occasionally five <laughs> times a year. Look, look yeah. I put it on the home screen of my phone so that I will see it and click it more often, okay? Proud. That would be great. Yeah, thanks. Hashtag proud. I yeah. said it as that already. <laughs> <laughs> but I would love to have you guys come and join us in Discord. Uh, we got a lot of stuff. There's an area for any nerd. And if there's not, just let me know and we'll make it. It's really not that hard. We have LTN Con coming up, and you want to be a part of LTN Con. LTNCon.info has all of the, you guessed it, info for LTN Con. Uh, boom, roasted. And so we're going to have it all online. It's going to be October the 3rd and the 4th. You're going to be able to watch it for free on Twitch. I don't know if I mentioned we have a, a, a Twitch channel. Barely. It's twitch.tv. No, I, I don't think you did. Yeah, twitch, twitch.tv slash love thy nerd. And all day long on on that channel for the third and the fourth, we're going to be streaming our main stage content. And then starting at about 7 p.m. Central time, 
Matt and I and friends, Beard Bro and company, are going to be streaming tabletop games and maybe some Tanner Honk. I don't know. We've got a lot of stuff <laughs> mm-hmm. with a lot of people that are going to be there. So we've got content upon content upon content. But go to ltncon.info to find out more about that. Yeah. Love also, I you. put that link in the description of this thing. And, uh, Ooh, we. Wonderful. A, the show notes somewhere. You're going to want to sign up. So You're going to want to sign up because that's the only place that you can get a a dope play mat. It's the only place you can get a uh, a one of a kind one run, one time run of the the coolies that we have. Um, it's going to be a, a special variant. Um, you can get the LTN Con T shirt, all sorts of stuff. Just join the Hundo Club. Hundred bucks gets you everything and makes a a, a tiny thirty dollar donation to LTN in the process of that as well. And as always, like I said, you can follow us on Twitter at Love Thy Nerd on all of those platforms. We got Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, all that stuff. Kate's blown it up over there. Love, love, love well, all the trying, stuff that's happening. Trying to. And she's also blown it up at Free Play Podcast on well, Twitter. I, I haven't posted in there for a well, while. You I'll post explosions. about Matt's cat's name, so we'll see. Okay. Absolutely. Can't wait. I can't wait. Well, but I guess, Matt, we're both going to have to. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that's just how it works. Will. You'll have to wait. Sorry. <laughs> oh man well hey you know what that's going to do it for us here on episode 101 of the free play podcast once again i'm bubba stalkup i'm matt warmbier i'm kate kotawaki and for our cut man jonathan clausen we'll catch you next week and if nobody else tells you this i promise it's true jesus loves you nerd You have been listening to the Free Play Podcast with Bubba Stallcup, Matt Warmbier, and Kate Katawaki, part of the Love Thy Nerd Podcast Network. Be sure to rate and review the show and share on all the social media. I'm sorry, I was on my own beat. Can we do that again?